Yeah, that's really cool. It opens Friday. It's a really sought out exhibit. It's called Sanford Biggers Code Switch. That's the name of the artist, too. So we're kind of making our way through this exhibit this morning, giving you a first look before it opens to the public. We have curator Scott here with the Speed Art Museum. This work is incredible. How would you describe it to people who are interested in coming to the show? Well, I think, uh, you know, you begin with these objects where Sanford has started with antique American quilts um, and then started to add new meanings onto them. You know, the ones we're seeing here, such as this one in the center, um, deal with themes of spirituality, uh, whether that's the Christian tradition or the Buddhist tradition. Um, this one with the windows that we see here um, is titled Ecclesiastes 1 after the biblical passage that deals with the vanity of life. Um, so some really powerful meanings embedded in these and it, you know, he encourages you to just look at them, enjoy them, but also try to decode what's going on because th these objects do have so much going on in them. I was going to say the name code switch is in the exhibit title. Yes. What's the point of that? Well, code switching is a term associated with ling linguistics where language can change depending on context. Okay. So. Here, he's applying it in a way to the objects, too, where their contexts are changing as he works with old objects, intervenes with them, and creates something new. I just noticed that this has like a QR code on it. Is it an active QR code, or is that uh, part of it? Yeah, this will, t will take you to uh, one of the artist's websites. Yep. Okay, nice. And as, as the farther we get into this exhibit, the more glitter I see. Yeah, you do see him <laughs> starting to incorporate that. I think that's a really clever way to add, again, a sense of three-dimensionality to yeah. the work, too. And speaking of, it doesn't get uh, more 3D yeah. than this. This is incredible. Yeah, this is a piece titled Big Dada. Uh, Dada referring to an early 20th century art movement, but oftentimes when you look at the title Sanford uses, he's engaging in wordplay, so referencing mm -hmm. Big Dada, mm -hmm. too. And you do get this in the, this geometric structure, I think, the idea of fractal geometry and, and other things going on here, beginning with a, a quilt pattern, a very popular one in the 19th century, 20th century, known as the log cabin, which mm -hmm. has this, on its own, has this three-dimensional quality, right. and then articulating that by adding it onto this wooden framework. It is incredible to see how he um, adds his own stuff to it and kind of modernizes these quilts that we have, you know, many of us have grown up seeing being made or seeing it just anywhere in our lives. So it's really a cool exhibit to come and walk through. It opens tomorrow, and it's going to be here for quite a while here at the Speed Art Museum, so you have some time to come see it. And we're going to continue the last leg of the exhibit uh, next time, guys.